Hello, my friends, and welcome. Thank you for joining me today for our devotion. Let's concentrate on the words of Scripture found in John chapter 1, verses 36 through 37, for these moments of devotion with our Good Shepherd. And there we read, when John the baptizer saw Jesus passing by, he said, Look, the Lamb of God. When the two disciples heard him say this, they followed Jesus. Some years ago, groups of young people who acknowledged Jesus as Savior and changed their lifestyle accordingly were called Jesus people, or <clears throat> less elegantly, Jesus freaks. The real Jesus people have been around for nearly 2,000 years. The first converts were two sets of brothers, Peter and Andrew, James and John. Then came Philip and Nathaniel and the rest of the 12 disciples. After Jesus' ascension into heaven, the followers numbered 120 men and women. On Pentecost Day, that number suddenly soared by 3,000 newly baptized Christians, and soon the figure jumped to 5,000. Much to the dismay of the authorities in Jerusalem, the people of Jesus, or the people, the Jesus people, filled all the city with their doctrine, and then other cities were evangelized. The Disciples were first called Christians in Antioch. To be the people of Jesus is both a hard task and a pleasant privilege. It's often hard to confess Jesus' name boldly and articulately before the general public. It may even bring ridicule. But it's also an honor to bear his name. For he honored and accepted us, sinful as we were, redeemed us with his blood, and made us God's children. It is a privilege to be associated with Jesus, to think his thoughts after him, to speak his words, and to live his kind life. <clears throat> as Jesus' people, we continue in his word. Then we shall know the truth, and the truth will set us free, free from fears and anxieties, free for a life of joyful service to him, says the hymn writer, and then for work to do for thee, which shall so sweet a service be, that angels might envy me. We pray. O oh, Holy Spirit, strengthen my faith, and so make me a better Jesus person. Amen. Well, my friends, know that you are a Jesus person, and thank God every day by living as a Jesus person and telling others.